Hi, I'm Omar and I'm a programmer. Today I'm going to show you how to create a lightsaber effect on a Mac. Now what you're going to use for this is Photoshop uh, because that's how you use to edit photos. So once you get Photoshop, go ahead and open up the photo where you want to place your lightsaber. I have this picture opened up already on my Photoshop and we'll begin with the tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is select the circle uh, marquee tool and basically just trace out a nice long round lightsaber. I think this would be a good shape for a lightsaber. Then you go ahead and create a new layer down here and then fill the layer with whatever color you want to fill it with. For instance, I'm going to make a red lightsaber. So let's go ahead and fill it with the foreground color, which is red. So now that we have that, we go ahead and click anywhere on the screen so that the selection goes away. And then we copy the layer two more times. We go to the first layer and select filter and go to blur, Gaussian blur. And we want to set the blur radius for this first layer to five. On the second layer, we'll do the same thing. However, we're going to set the blur radius to 10. And on the third layer, we'll do this one last time. Uh, we'll go to blur, Gaussian blur, but for the radius, we'll set it to 20. Now, as you see that there's already a fuzzy effect going on. Now, you wanna, I want to take all these layers and for the blending options, I want to put them as screen for every single one of these layers. Once I've done that, I'll select all the layers and click Layer, Merge Layers. After they've been merged, I'll go ahead and select Screen again. And now I have a, a lightsaber here, a red lightsaber that's sort of semi-transparent. I'll press Control T so I can move the lightsaber around. As, as you can see, I'll just put it in her hand over here. And there you have it. A lightsaber effect using Photoshop on the Mac. I'm Omar and I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a good day.